With these kinds of questions, the best way to handle it is to kind of think in terms of dumb summaries. You may read this paragraph and have your own kind of instinct for what you would do, whether you would include the sentence or not, and that's fine. I can't prevent you from having that instinct, but you always need to verify it with the answer choices because they can be a little tricky sometimes. So in this case, you know, maybe you think it's interesting that Daniel Boone did this, but if we look at just the dumb summary of this paragraph, look, where's Daniel Boone appear? Nowhere, right? So we talk about bison, we're talking about the routes that they take, traces, and look, it keeps coming up. Bison, uh, they're, uh, that they're going through the traces here, navigation, okay, the pioneers are doing it, migration again here, traces again, um, roads, right? So we're, we're talking about the bison and the roads. Why do I care about what Daniel Boone is doing. Uh, it seems kind of like a random fact. Now, maybe you think it is related because it's an example of what we're talking about. So let's take a look. Cho choice A, yes, because it reinforces the idea that traces were originally made by bison. Well, no, it does not. It says Daniel Boone is making the path, right? So it does not do that. This is just maybe it, that the because part is wrong here. Choice B, yes, because it clarifies information about the previous sentence about the location of the Cumberland Gap. Again, it doesn't do that. I don't know where the Cumberland Gap is located based on this Daniel Boone sentence. It's not doing that. So even if your instinct was, this is a good fact, it helps us understand the context of these, these buffalo traces, fine, but now we have two answer choices that just have dumb reasons for adding it. So your reason isn't in the choices, therefore we're not gonna add it. We have to add it for the reasons that are listed here. So that leaves us with getting rid of it. So why would we get rid of it? Well, it is not necessary for understanding the relationship between the bison and roads. That seems to hit my dumb summary pretty well. So that seems like a good answer. Look at D though, it goes a little bit further. It does not provide enough information about Daniel Boone's impact on westward expansion. Well. That's true, it doesn't do that, but why would I need it to, right? That's not the point of the paragraph, so I don't care about Daniel Boone for the rest of this paragraph, so having more information about him would not help here. So the real reason is that it's just an unrelated fact, and this is a very common reason to get rid of these sentences. So just look for that choice, and if you are between the two delete options, usually the one that's weaker is better. So D is very specific, and so C ends up being the right answer.